Yo, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on, traders? I hope you're all having a good time. It's Rafael back at the charts again, and I want to talk about yesterday's trading day because yesterday I shared a trade with all my students from the masterclass course. I shared a Nasdaq sell. It was phenomenal timing. I took partials. I took 80% off the table. Made around 450,000. So. I mean, the last video I made a huge loss and I told you I need two good trades to get it back. Yesterday, I took that first good trade and I nearly, I already got like 50% of my big loss back. So I made around 450,000 yesterday on that NASDAQ drop. It was beautiful. I still have some running. Let's see if we can get like a bit, the big drop until the 12,000 area. We will see. I'm going to hold it. It's like 20, a little bit less than 20% of my initial position. That's the running. And yeah, I shared this trade with everybody inside the Inner Circle group chat. All my students had the chance to capitalize on that trade as well. And in today's video, I want to talk about why I took that trade so you can learn. And hopefully in the future, you will earn with that knowledge. So let's see what we had, guys. First of all, like you can see, like we had equal highs in here from Tuesday, right? This was Tuesday's low. These, these are equal highs in here. And... I really wanted to see this thing go back down because overall we're in a big downtrend as you can see like in a really huge downtrend for the last couple of weeks we're just going down as you can see and we had a huge push last week and it's just a matter of time until this thing drops again you know so this is what was in my mind and I was waiting for that move I wanted to I wanted them to show me when they are ready to drop right and above these equal highs, there's a lot of business for them to do. Trick a lot of buys into the market, you know, create a lot of liquidity so they can get like their big sell positions into the market and get this thing down. So this is what they did. Let me show it to you on the one minute time frame. On the one minute time frame, you can see beautifully how they turned the price around, how they turned the market around, it. like above these equal highs. You can see what is happening in here. So. Remember guys 930 New York time is when the markets and when the algorithms start to kick in so around in this time 930 they push price above these equal highs tricked a lot of buyers into the market and then they turned the price around like they broke structure like they broke structure first time in here on the small time frame but then they really broke this structure significantly in here so on that pullback could have been a nice entry as well i was i was a little bit later on that one i took that trade on my phone uh, i was not in front of my screen because i had some i have some friends here I, uh, I took my girl from the airport and we're here to have a good time you know so i'm not super focused on trading right now but i i check every day and see if i can get a nice entry and i'm just i'm just taking like super high probability trades to get this 900,000 back okay so what was happening in here we could have made like the first beautiful entry on the one minute time frame it would be a nice sniper entry with a beautiful risk reward ratio like taking some profits around in this uh, around in this zone in here this would, would have been like if I would have taken this entry I would have taken some profits off the table somewhere in this area in here like with a beautiful risk reward ratio right this would have been like amazing risk reward ratio maybe of 4 to 1 or something like that but I was a little bit later, I, I, I was waiting for a little bit more confluence and I was seeing like the price really wants to push down like crazy. So at around the 700 area, somewhere in here I decided to step into the game, put my stop above the high and then just let it run until Tuesday's lows. This is where I wanted to take first partials around 80% of the table. This is what I told my students, I want to take partials at around like the 12,500 area somewhere in here around the days before low right Tuesday's low and this is where the market really made like a huge pullback because this is where uh, where a lot of liquidity was sitting so this is where most of the time the profit taking begins and then price shoots back up and luckily I was not getting stopped out I still have a position running I can show you I still have a little bit less than 20% 20, 20 running. It is around 90 grand in profit right now. I hope this thing will drop some more. I hope this thing is going down some more. Uh, I mean, if we can get back into this 12,000 area, would have been another 320,000. 
with like 20% of my position and if I would if I'm going to bank this one mm, then I nearly got all the losses back that I made on that Friday last week Friday that shitty fucking Friday um, yeah patience guys I'm just gonna wait it out see what it does for now it already made like a pretty aggressive drop before the algorithm started to kick in the algorithm start to kick in in like 17 minutes let's see what they do maybe they're gonna bring price back up above this high stop me out we will see I don't know but it would be great to see like a huge drop Thursday and Friday I want to see this thing go down make some money and then I would be happy let's see what happens guys uh, we cannot control it we can just move with the flow and I mean like I'm just trying to let it run now and see if we can get that big runner and yeah that's it if you've missed that trade you're probably not inside the inner circle yet I don't know why you still watching my videos you're not inside the inner circle with all our students I don't know why but you should really get inside because you're going to learn how to make real big money in the markets you're gonna learn how to get funded how to get capital from from these prop firms like FTMO and stuff you're gonna learn all that stuff so it's a no-brainer get inside learn all our strategies learn all our money management systems trade management systems learn all that stuff set up your own game plan like you get so, so many ideas inside the course you should just take the ideas create a game plan back test the game plan test it out talk to other students learn from their experience learn from my experience and become a profitable trader and make this year unforgettable this is what you should do take action guys get inside the price is going to change soon i'm going to upload the twenty-five thousand dollar challenge ftmo challenge soon and then i'm going to attack the fifty thousand dollar challenge and i'm just doing this for you guys i don't need that funded money i'm just doing these challenges to show you exactly what kind of trade setups i take and how i'm managing to pass these challenges in inside of this 30 days most of the time i just need like seven or eight trading days with half percent one percent risk most of the time half percent risk one percent only if i have like if i took a couple of winners you know but anyways we're going to talk about all that stuff inside the course <coughs> i recorded all that stuff like all that trades you can see exactly how i'm managing my trades and i think that's that's a big deal. I mean, I'll show you how to get really big capital, six figures, seven figures capital to trade with. And if you become a skilled funded trader, you can make a lot of money and it's the best way to get started as a beginner trader. Like, not as a beginner trader, but as a, as a tr developing beginner trader, you know. As soon as you have a profitable strategy, you can get so much money from, from these prop firms, trade with their capital and then like get the big chunk of the, your profits into your pocket I mean that's that sounds beautiful and it is beautiful I'm telling you guys so take action guys make this year unforgettable get on your grind stay disciplined stay patient stay patient to wait for your setups stay disciplined just trade your setups stay disciplined with your risk management and you will make a lot of money this year I promise guys so that's it I'm going to have fun now just let this thing run let's see what it does i'm just gonna wait it out i'm not gonna trade tomorrow last friday was a big lesson i'm not gonna trade tomorrow and destroy my weekend i'm just going to let it run and hopefully we're gonna get the big run let's see guys wish you all the best see you in the next video make sure to subscribe and smash that like button peace out
Everybody in the room.